Well, the chemicals in sunscreen can absorb into your bloodstream after just one day. That's according to a startling new study released by the FDA. It found the chemicals are entering the bloodstream at levels high enough to trigger a government safety investigation. So what does this mean for you and your family as we near summer? Alicia digging deeper into the study this morning in our digital dive. Yeah, Chris, we know sunblock helps protect us from the sun's harmful UV rays. But as you just mentioned, we never really done intensive studies on what happens after that sunscreen absorbs into your body. And the FDA did complete research on a dozen chemical sunscreens and found four different chemicals remain in the body for, as you said, at least 24 hours. So what are those four chemicals? Well, avobenzone, oxybenzone, octocrylene, and ecamsoul. None of us really know what these are, right? Right, and neither do they really. They're still doing scientific research on them. The FDA says if an ingredient is absorbed through the body, it doesn't really mean it's unsafe just yet, and more testing actually needs to be done to determine risks, whether it might cause birth defects, cancer. They don't know that, that yet, but they want to remind folks, don't let the study scare you. Keep on wearing that sunscreen. They do say other options are barrier sunscreens that have zinc oxide and titanium dioxide. They don't have those chemicals that absorb into your skin. So a few options, but again, the big thing is keep wearing that sunscreen because as we had yesterday, melanoma Monday, skin mm -hmm. cancer, still a huge risk. And like they said, they still have a lot of research to do. This is a fairly new study that they've done.